You have a daughter? I have a daughter, yep. Let me elaborate on her a little bit. Isa, that's my daughter. I had her when I was um, 16. I was 16. Yeah, I was 16, man. And yeah, you can only imagine what my mom said and how crazy she went. <laughs> I was 16. Man, I've been with my girl. I've been with my girl since we was like, man, 9th, 10th grade. That's when we met, when we was like 13 or 14 years old. She got pregnant like junior year. She got pregnant. She got pregnant, um, man, that was like one of the, oh, man, I'll never forget that. Like, when I told my mother that, my, that she was pregnant, that was like, I've never seen my mom act like that. She went crazy. But it's just funny, it's just such a blessing, you know what I'm saying, that she's here today. And I'm just so happy, you know what I'm saying, that my daughter's here today. But you can only imagine how rough that was for me, you know, as a teen and back then today. I feel like God won't give you anything that you can't handle, you know, so being a father was just something that I think I was called to do at a young age, and I think it had a lot to do. I think I had to grow up fast. I had to learn a lot fast, be responsible fast. I couldn't really have had time to play around and go through the little bullshit that people go through. I had to grow up into a man fast, and, and just having a daughter, I think that's that was the reason why God gave me a daughter that early. I'm real spiritual, so I don't, you know what I'm saying, I don't really... I, I just think things happen for a reason. I feel like it's happened for a reason. I don't think, you know, I'm just, you know, she's three now. She'll be four next year. She's three now, so it's a blessing. Are you still um, in a relationship with your baby mother? Yeah, man. We, um, man, she, she, she a real one, for real. She, um, I ain't never talked to, but this is the first time I've talked about that. You know what I'm saying? I usually don't even really speak on it, but I try to keep it because I think it's just important because, it's, you know, something like a, a relationship is very sacred. And I know a lot of people, especially rappers in today, they don't, you know, it's just like, it's not, but it's, it's a little bit more. I'm kind of old school. I got an old soul. You know what I'm saying? I really don't believe in a lot of the same things I think a lot of people in my industry do. You know what I'm saying? So I think that that's why I don't speak on it a lot. And she don't, you wouldn't even know, you know what I'm saying? That because she's not really a female that anybody would know. You know what I'm saying? This is somebody that I grew up with. We grew up together. And we had a child together. So we share a lot of important things together. And that's important, but I keep it away. And I'm, I'm going to continue to kind of keep her away from just all the, you know, because that's just like, man, that's just sacred. Just your home and your family. At the end of the day, man, when all the, the dust roll out and the smoke clear out, and and you can't take none of that with you. You know what I'm saying? The family and love, peace, all that, that's the only thing you're really going to have. And I learned that early. I learned that at a young age, so that kind of keep me grounded. You know, my daughter, you know, her mother, my family, and, and, you know, my mother even. It just keeps me grounded, just understanding just how important that is. I think people, they lose track and just, you know. I mean, I still be having, we still be having our arguments. We just got done getting into it just now because, you know, of course time gets in the way. I can't always spend as much time as I want to back in the day. Everything I do is for one reason. It's for it's for my family. Family ties is is out. Go get that. <laughs> What's your opinion of um Black China and Tiger going through it right now? They got a little one. Yeah. And uh Amber Rose and Wiz Khalifa custody situation is honestly I, honestly I, honestly my opinion on that is that I think people spend too much time like even like that alone you know us talking about it it's so important when it's so much more that's important than that you know what i'm saying like it's so many more things going on in this world that's more important than tiger and black china and then amber rose and wiz you know what i'm saying people invest so much time into so much other people's life and it's like i mean i ain't gonna sit here and act like i agree with them guys you know what i'm saying i mean they knew what they was in for you know what i'm saying like, I don't, that ain't me. That's not something that I would do. But at the end of the day, I just feel like I don't, I, I just can't sit there and elaborate on it that much because it's so not important to me. It's so many more things that's important to me just in this world that's going on, just in our culture, just in music, just in, I'm very opinionated about a lot of things. So I just, I don't, but well, my opinion is, 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 is about, I, if, I'd rather talk about something that's way deeper than that because, I don't know, they just, I, that, it's just all foolishness and I feel like it's just brainwashing everybody. Well, the reason why I'm asking is because... Oh, I know why you understand. 
you're tight with your baby mother. Right, right, and right. And you and you feel like, and you're in the music business, mm-hmm. and you rap. So does Tiger. So does Wiz. Mm-hmm. And and they have a little one. Right. But they're breaking apart. You know what I'm saying? So it's just kind of, which I'm just asking your opinion, just because you know, just kind of interested to see how you feel about seeing something like that in comparison to what you got going on. I'm just I think, curious. I think it's because. Uh, I give you my opinion. I think it's because I think those type of things happen, you know, due to media. And, you know what I'm saying, when you meet somebody, when you up there, when you meet somebody in the public eye, it's kind of like, yeah, they they all met in fame. Like, they met probably somewhere where all the cameras seen the first time that they met. So how can that ever really be like, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. It's just, how can that really ever be? something real, you know what I'm saying? Cause I don't know if you know me for real or love me for really me for with nothing. Like if I ain't had none of this, if I wasn't who I am, or even if I liked you, if you ain't had, you know what I'm saying? So I think that has a lot to do with it. And then, you know, I really can't speak too much on it, but I hate to see, you know, when people have ch- children involved and, and then they and then they split up. Cause at the end of the day, I've been through that, you know what I'm saying? And when parents get, get into it and they go back and forth, only person that gets hurt is the child at the end of the day. And I've been through the same thing with my parents, you know what I'm saying? And I just had to kind of understand, like, and that's one thing I don't never want to take my daughter through, you know? I don't want to take her through having to choose between parents or having to choose, uh, you know, what side to be on because that's not fair for her. It's not fair to, to even want to put a child through that. So I'd rather keep it together, you know what I'm saying? It just make more sense for me. But I'm like I said, I'm old school a little bit, so... Everybody probably don't think like that. 